Welcome to Fallen from the Moon by Fast Games and GammyStar.com. In case you couldn't figure out how to form a URL, they're helping you. There you go, GammyStar. Oh, GammyStar. Thank you for correcting me. There once was a boy who lived on the moon. Until one day his world was turned upside down and the moon got really fat. And then he hit his head on the ground. This is Fallen from the Moon by Gammy Star. Coming to theaters near you in 2084. Is this one of those point and click thingies? There we go. Via click the thing. Fast games is in the sky for some reason. Alright, it's a point and click thingy. I think this might be related to Easy Joe. I see it's in the recommendations. Easy Joe is another point-and-click thingy. I don't usually play these, but whatever. He's got a little lift. Let's attack the bear with the saw. Oh, we're cutting a branch with the saw. How is he... How is... Who is interacting with this scene here? I, I never understand what's going on here. Because it's obviously not him. Yay. We're just some sort of omniscient being that somehow lacks the ability to just move this guy's butt back on the moon over there. Uh, let's cut open the pinata with a sword. Oh, we can't. Lame. Oh, it's all squeaky. Squeaky. Let's cut down the tree with an axe. Amazingly quickly. That was incredibly quick. Chopping down trees is not quite that amazingly fast. Some sort of projector screen. There's a bunny and a cat. The cat's going to go slaughter the bunny horrifically. Oh, the humanity. Oh, the bun manity! I have no idea what the hell this thing is. Um, there we go. It's ground. Apparently that was weird. Well, there's a box and some sparks. Go touch the live wire. Um... <laughs> I didn't expect he'd actually do that. That is awesome. Look, we got a key. That opens this box. This is definitely a lot like Joe's adventure. Or Easy Joe. It's Joe's adventure. Oh, he doesn't try to lick the... Anyway. Bunny wants a carrot. There's a carrot right freaking behind you if you would stop chewing that electrical wire. You are, you are ridiculous, sir. You are ridiculous. Aw, oh, I... Thought he was gonna go up and touch the wire. Touch live wires, kids. They're fun. No, don't really. I click the gear. Oh snap! Well, there's lots of gold here, but this guy does he even have a name? He does not care for such riches. We've got a pickaxe. Oh well, I'm looking for secrets that don't exist. Wait, what? Oh, because of that apparently. No? There's more? Oh. Okay, I get it. That was sort of odd. Um, this is some, this is the prince from Katamari or something. There's a thing. There's a lift. Why do I always call them lifts in video games? They're, I'm not British. Uh, touch the sparky thing. Oh, holy, whoa. That's kind of disturbing. Oh, hello. It's the prince. Please don't roll us into a Katamari. Well, get in it, you dumb fat thing. There you go. You're mostly just square, not really fat. Hello. You're some sort of traveling salesman that wants... fish. Well, cast your line, for one thing. Why did that fish fly in the sky? That's not what fish are supposed to do. Oh, we got... There we go, we got bait, we got a fish. The fish goes in the guy's hands, a boat comes out of freaking nowhere. Let's steal his boat, because he's eating. Always steal people's stuff. This guy's snowman, is, his face is inside of his torso, he's some sort of horrific abomination. There is his snowman wife, who's just brooding over her husband's horrific fate. Now her husband has a head again, let's put his face back on. Give him a nose. He's waving. Um, oh, he waves. Um, can we go now? There you go. Oh, it's a penguin! This was like some sort of Mother Teresa snowman. Can we go now? 
There we go. But he just walks right past them. Oh, these batteries are bad, and we don't like them. Let's get the good batteries. Blue and green things are good, and red things are bad. As always. There we go. I wonder what's going through this guy's mind, as he's just like, Oh, magical stuff is happening! Yay! Oh god. My, my head is inside of my ass. That's disconcerting. And this guy's like, Hail Hitler! And, uh, there's this dog- that dog just crapped out a key, that's- that's really disturbing. Let's see if we can kill this Nazi. Pretty sure we probably can. There you go. Oh, we need three keys. There's three keys. Aw, he's- he's happy now. He's in love with this other- he's in- hetero- he's in homo-robotic love. I uh, just go. Uh, and my head warped out of my ass. That's wonderful. Um... I pressed a button, there's a lift, and he's all like, oh, I want to go on that thing. There's a dominoes. I don't, I'm not sure what's going on here. Stupid dominoes, I want you to go. Why aren't you going? There's a gear, button, gears. Okay, the gears are going. Do something. Oh, hey, the moon is less fat, or something. It's been several days already, apparently. Which is kind of amazing. I honestly don't know what to press. Oh wow, you can press tab. I'm... I didn't think that would work. I'm just going to ignore that. Um, button press? Something, go. Okay, there was no reason for that you couldn't do that before, was there? Why didn't you let me? I just kept trying to get that to work. Now let's go. Well, what's the problem? Now go. Jeez. Hello, Mr. Dog. Or Mr. Cat. I can't really tell. There's a shovel. There's a horrific skeleton. Um, go eat the skeleton dog or something. Oh. I, I wasn't serious. What is your problem? That's very disrespectful. Dogs. No respect for the dead. Look at that jerk hole. Anyway, we got a we got a valve, we got a bridge. Let's fix up that bridge. Move whatever the hell that is over there. Let's press this and not do anything. Turn the valve. Water pressure, go! Oh wait, it's like pipe pressure. I don't know what just happened. I just increased water pressure and a pipe shot out and I blew stuff up. Um, gas can. Button. Um, crane, not wrench. Um, yeah, drop that stuff down for no reason. What? That's my problem with this game. Stuff will just be stuck, and you drop, and you click other stuff, and all of a sudden it works. It's not logically connected, though. Okay, that's an oil can, not like a fire can or something. I wish I had cans full of liquid fire. I'm not sure what... Oh, I bet he gets picked up. Yep. That would be incredibly painful in real life. It would probably just remove your limb. Um, explode. The moon is this way, despite the moon being right over there. Um, maybe this goes all the way around the world, and then you get up into space or something. I don't know. Okay, there we go. Can you go? No, you can't. Okay, so these go up, obviously. Uh, switch. Oh. See, what? there was no reason... There's no apparent reason why that switch couldn't have been acti activated before. Pfft, that... He keeps flying past the moon. He's apparently flown around the world multiple times. Anyway, he's back with the moon now, and he's all happy, and love is spurting out of his ears, which is really pretty gross. But the moon is all happy, and it looks like one of those cyanide and happiness characters. With a big bite taken out of his face. Which would kind of make sense in it. I don't know what's on his head there. It's like a hat, but it has a face on it. I don't I don't know. Anyway, this is Fallen from the Moon by Ga Games Gamey Star. Why can't I say that? Whatever. It's that. Yes.